um, consultative meeting with some of our um, leaders in various 19 northern states to brainstorm and um, strategize on the um, the primaries that is coming up and subsequently the election for 2023. 100% um, yes, I'm 100% hopeful and believing that next year we shall be clinching um, the winning of the ele presidential election because of so many reasons. Number one. God has been very faithful with the kind of structure that we have too. Nigerians are tired. We have gotten to the apogee of our of our suffering. Bad roads, no electricity, insecurity, education, lack of poor education. You know, we are just at the very, very base of whatsoever um, economic hardship any country can ever dream of. So Nigerians are tired and Nigerians youth, women, will decide coming 2023. Kudos to INEC who have been trying to, in their own best way, to to harmonize the electoral processes with the introduction of um, new systems like BVAS that we believe that, well, to a large extent, the, the, this election would prove um, to be a little bit improved as compared to other, other elections. It, again, that gives hope to young aspirants to knowing that uh, whatever work you do, whatever vote you have, would eventually count. So I also want to encourage you out there that they should be courageous. This is our country. This is the only country we have. We must all come out to redeem our country. You know, so many of the old ones who govern us today have run out of ideas. Many of them are not in tune with the reality on ground. Nigerians are suffering. One out of three Nigerians cannot write or read. Eh? Our, our, our vulnerables and the less privileged does not have hope. What is the hope of the Nigerian people? So we must all come out to redeem our nation. I believe in the system and we have hope in it and we believe we will also make it work by ensuring that um, what the abnormalities that um, we've been seeing in the process would make sure that it's fine tuned through so many means like, um, to ensure that at least the mandate of the people eventually emerged. <laughs> One, the unemployment rate, we have over 70 million Nigerian youth, Nigerians generally, who are unemployed and underemployed. We are going to create a digital economy to encourage Nigerians who have digital skills to start getting jobs around in and around their workplace. We are going to make sure that we have 24 hours of electricity, at least to start with, with basic from, um, from basic cities around Nigeria. We are going to um, um, revamp to making sure that Nigeria becomes a productive economy from a consuming economy. We are going to make sure that we revamp all abandoned projects. Because it's not about glory, who, who, who started it. It's about what we need to do for Nigeria economy. We will be faithful to making sure that every Nigerian Nigeria income is channeled back to developing the country. We so do it. Nigeria will become one. We are going to integrate again, and the Nigerian youth will have hope in the country. Very obvious. Is a youth. I believe in that. Is for my party. Accord. We should be tired of PDP APC by now. So very obvious. And that's why I'm supporting you, and I believe in you. He has the capacity. What we all have to do. We have to do this thing together. That's what we have to do. Are we not tired of what Nigeria is all about today? We should something new in our lives. 